Is Carline the real gentleman from Parfums to Marley? Let's find out. Hi and welcome to Rotten Rebel. I love everything about scent and I know a thing or two that will make you smell amazing. So make sure you subscribe right now. So in this review, I will be taking a closer look at Parfums de Marlis Carlisle and I will let you know how I feel about it. Some of the notes in Carlisle are apple, saffron, nutmeg, you also have tonka bean and rose, and then you have some tobacco, vanilla, sandalwood, and also a bit of patchouli. The bottle is in the same design as the other ones in the Parfums de Marlin line, except that it's black and the sprayer is, as you can see, really good. So how does Carlisle smell? Well, to me, the opening can be a bit harsh and that's because this has a bitter kind of apple. You can also feel a pretty strong dose of that nutmeg together with a bit of saffron. A lot of people feel that the opening can be a bit tough and I agree, but just give it a few minutes, let it dry down and you'll get to enjoy the finest side of Carline. The blend becomes smoother after a few minutes when that apple blends together with tonka and a hint of rose. That rose is just a slight hint of it. It takes a back seat to the rest of the composition and I feel that this is more sweet than anything else. As it dries down you get some of that vanilla that Parfums de Marly is so famous for that you can find in many of their other perfumes and that comes together with some patchouli, some smokiness and sandalwood. And this is the part that I really, really fell in love with. It's like apple pie meets vanilla cake together with an elegant woody side, a bit of patchouli and some smokiness. And the result is something that I feel is sweet, elegant and posh. Carlisle is definitely gourmandy, but that smoky and woody side perfectly balance up the sweetness. So this is not really overly sweet. It's perfectly balanced as it is. And I feel it's really fantastic. Carlisle has always brought me a feeling of elegance, no matter what my outfit is. It doesn't matter if I'm wearing a suit or jeans together with a leather jacket this makes me feel elegant. It has a sweet, luxurious, elegant and posh kind of vibe to it. And that's exactly how I feel when I have it on and I love it. I don't have a 100% hit rate when it comes to compliments, but if someone gets a whiff of Carlisle, then chances are that they are going to tell me that I smell good. And I recently started using Carlisle for layering and the compliments I've received when I've layered this with other perfumes have been insane. So I highly, highly recommend you to try layering Carlisle together with other perfumes for some wicked, wicked, wicked reactions. It stays on my skin for hours and hours and it gets me noticed for several hours as well. So I feel that Carlisle has excellent sillage and longevity. Use Carlisle whenever you want a scent that's elegant, sweet and has a woody side to it. I feel that it's perfect for formal events, for a date or simply when you want to impress someone. This is luxurious, a bit posh, a bit sweet, slightly smoky and a bit woody and it's just really, really nice and elegant. I think the opening of Carlisle leans just a little bit towards the male side, but that sweet woody dry down is pretty much unisex, but I need to share this with you. I've asked quite a few women what they think about Carlisle and pretty much every single one of them has told me that they feel that this is a perfume for men. So who should buy Carlisle? 
Well, if you are looking for an elegant kind of perfume with a gourmandish feel to it that's slightly smoky, a bit woody, then I feel that this is perfect. This is really, a, to me at least, a luxurious, posh and elegant kind of scent. And if that's what you are going for, then yeah, I really recommend this one. So how am I going to rate Carlyle? I think that this is a really luxurious, elegant and well-made perfume. I love wearing it and it always brings me compliments. Well, almost. Uh, so I feel that this is a solid eight. I thoroughly enjoy wearing it. It usually brings me compliments. Not that it matters, but it's a nice bonus. And yeah, I do recommend Carlisle uh, if you are looking for something a bit more luxurious, posh, sweet, woody, tobacco-ish. Mm -mm -mm. So I'm curious on how you feel about Carlisle. Do you agree with me that it's a really good gentleman kinds of perfume, that it feels elegant with that sweetness, that woody side, that slight smokiness and all that? I would really love to know how you feel about Carlisle, so please do comment below and let me know. And don't forget to subscribe guys, I would love to have you around. And please make sure to like this video if you enjoyed it. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.